is always a man of few words. You tell me when you've heard him speak when, in, in our lessons. He puts his work in there, don't you? Hi, this is Leon House and Natasha Crawley, and we are interviewing Dan. So, Dan, what's your plans after the public service course? Uh, I'm going to the army, uh, combat engineer, as an armoured engineer. Uh, I'm just waiting for a start date, which I should be getting a phone call either this week or next week. Do you think uh, the public service course has helped you? Yeah, massively, because like, when, we, when we joined, uh, we could pick a, a pathway, and uh, in that pathway, you're with people that share the same interests. Would you recommend public services to anybody else? Yeah. Um, I think they need to come with um, some like, aspirations and ideas of what we're going to be doing afterwards. Um, because, like, you can get help from the tutors and stuff. Like, um, the thing that helped me was standing up in front of the group of people and, like, talking about myself and other things. <coughs> in the application process for the army, um, I got asked to stand up in front of people and say stuff. So that's a big help. If you were to do this course again, what would you change about it? Uh, I'd change uh, how long it is, because I, I, I think personally that uh, it could be done in a year. Um, we worked really hard, uh, but two years is a bit long, I think um, people get a bit like sidetracked and stuff. What about trips? Have you been on any trips on this course, apart from Lynette? I've been on loads. I've been on a uh, Royal Navy trip from Portsmouth. I've been on uh, two Royal Marine uh, Commando trips with the Limes. I've been to the Peaks last year, uh, residential, like camping and walking. Uh, I've been to Linnet, this is my third time here. Um, I went right training as well last year. Need more oil on. I'll take it off the heat a little bit. It's not going to like one of your feet, No. Yeah. Right, the, um, the peppers off first and then put everything in the big bowl and it's done. Oh, I was going to give that a stir.